Minnesota went all in for Rudy Gobert. Cleveland went all in for Donovan Mitchell. And now it's time for the Toronto Raptors to go all in for their own NBA superstar. No, I'm not talking about a Kawhi or DeRozan reunion. And I'm not trying to deport KD to Canada. I'm talking about one of the best Canadian players in the NBA, who's only 24 and playing for one of the worst teams in basketball. But wait, before I tell you who it is, let me first tell you why the Raptors core might be blown up really soon. Now, I know they just won a title in 2019, but take a look at all these contracts. Fred Van Vliet will be a free agent next year. Gary Trent Jr. is likely to opt out next summer. Siakam will be a free agent in 2024. So will OG Ananubi if he opts out. And if you believe the reports he's not happy in Toronto, he likely will. Don't forget about Scotty Barnes, the reigning rookie of the year, who will be up for a contract extension the same summer. Oh, and Precious Achua could also get an extension in 2024 too. So the Raptors know they can't keep the gang together, unless they roll out the Brinks truck for all of them, leaving them no money to add another star. So before money gets too tight, the Raptors need one more piece right now to push them over the top. But hold on, there's still one big problem. Toronto isn't a free agent destination. I mean, Jose Calderon and Anthony Parker are among their top free agent signings in franchise history. So they'll take a page from Minnesota and Cleveland and go big in a blockbuster trade, which is why they explored trading for KD over the summer and thought about trading for Donovan Mitchell too. Enter the Oklahoma City Thunder. Sam Presti is doing a full rebuild over in OKC, owning 28 draft picks over the next seven years. And with Chet Holmgren missing the entire year, they may be in for another year of tanking. But there's one rising star in OKC who's ready for superstardom right now. Shea Gilgis Alexander. The 24 year old averaged 24 and a half points and six assists last year. And the fit in Toronto seems all too perfect. SGA is an elite playmaker who can get to the rim. Something Toronto has been sorely lacking outside of Siakam. Not to mention that Gilgis Alexander is a Canada native born in Toronto and also played for Team Canada under guess who? Nick Nurse. But OKC probably wants to keep their star, especially since they gave him a $172 million extension in 2021. But don't forget, this is the modern NBA, and players can request a trade anytime they want. So why would SGA want out? Well, ball dominant Josh Giddy has been taking the reins, pushing Gilgis Alexander to more off ball play. The Thunder likely won't be competitive in the 2022 2023 season, and there's not a huge chance SGA makes an all-NBA team anytime soon, which means he could miss out on the $30 million all-NBA bonus in his contract. And if he does want out, the Raptors have the pieces to do it. Something like Ananube, Trent Jr., Achua, and a whole lot of picks. But as long as they keep Barnes, Van Fleet, and Siakam, the Raptors would skyrocket to a contender with one more elite bucket getter. Not only that, they can build around 21-year-old Barnes and 24-year-old SGA moving forward. So the blueprint is there. The fit is near perfect. And if Masai Ujiri and the Raptors want to add to their trophy case, they better pick up the phone soon.